was a good win for us. Our guys played hard. They played well for most part of the game. And we're happy to be 4-0. And, and we have an early flight tomorrow. So I understand uh, how challenging the tournament will be this week. And we're looking forward to it. I, th I thought we, we played some challenging games, some good teams, and I thought we did what we needed to do offensively and defensively. Uh, there's some things we have to improve on, uh, but uh, it was nice to get our freshmen acclimated and, and, and our returnees to come out and, and play against someone other than themselves. And, and uh, I thought the, uh, uh, the effort was there and, and the execution for the most part. And I'm sure we made our mistakes, but I thought we played pretty good basketball. Well, I think our, our entire guard rotation has played at a high level. Uh, they're sharing the basketball. We had 26 assists tonight. Uh, and uh, other than a few uh, careless turnovers here or there, uh, we, we've been taking care of the ball. Uh, so uh, they're finding each other. They're moving the ball. They're, they're making open shots because they're getting open shots. A and that was a big uh, point of emphasis going into the season that uh, we took too many contested jump shots last year. And Jordan has been a big catalyst because not only is he finding people for shots, he's making them himself. Well, we know what our weaknesses and our strengths, and we have to play to our strengths but improve on our weaknesses, uh, probably like most teams at this point. Uh, so uh, it's nice to win games while you understand what your weaknesses are and, and, and try to work on those. Well, I don't want to tell you all the weaknesses because uh, we, we, well, I, I think uh, you, you saw one is the, the offensive rebounding. I thought we did a decent job tonight, of, uh, especially in the second half. Uh, but uh, New Mexico had too many offensive rebounds last game against us. Um, a few of those were while we were going to block shots on one side. They cleaned it up on the other side and laid it in. Uh, but I think uh, we, we need to improve on our, uh, our defensive rebounding and, and limit the offensive rebounds of the other team. We were playing great team basketball, and, and I thought what stood out were, were the couple contested threes we took really stood out because they, looked, they didn't look as good as the other ones. Uh, and, and I think our players are understanding that. I, I really give them credit. We spent a lot of time watching our team as well as some other great teams, uh, whether it's in the NBA or college, share the basketball. Well, Caton is a, uh, an, an explosive scorer, shooter, uh, and, and he also uh, ha has been finding people. Uh, um, I don't think he had a ton of assists tonight, uh, but, but the last few games he's had two or three assists and, and made some great plays. So uh, he's, he's playing uh, excellent offensive basketball uh, and really improving as a player. So we, we certainly need his production. He's, 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 he plays starters minutes, uh, but he comes off the bench and gives us a nice boost. I haven't said anything to him. He just plays. Uh, we, we, I have a lot of confidence in Julian. He he's uh, he doesn't care how many points he scores. He had 10 assists and 11 rebounds tonight, and I think he had six points. But he 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 could care less if he scores a point. He just wants to play well and win. Chemezi's had two games with five block shots. In this game, he had three block shots. Uh, he's, he's a high-level athlete slash shot blocker. Uh, he's also a very skilled big man. You saw that pass tonight where he, he rebounded the ball with one hand and turned around and, and threw an assist uh, to his teammate down low. So uh, he gives us extra size, athleticism, and, and, and tremendous shot blocking, wh which we didn't have last year. It just adds to our depth, adds to our um, it really complements uh, uh, Chemezi and Benny Bowright, our other freshmen, complement uh, what we already had. Uh, so, so it's a nice mix of talent. You came as a floater in high school. Have you broken into that? 
well, he's a typical freshman. He'll, he'll go through his growing pain, so to speak. But but uh, I'm very proud of Chemezi and, uh, and Benny, both of them. They, they, they work extremely hard. They're gym rats. They're in here before practice. They stay after. They're very attentive in the film sessions, and they're learning the college game. And, and, and so far, they've played ex exceptionally well. They kind of going through a few of them through last year, you know, up the ups and downs of the freshman. Well, the, the bigger thing, the, the uh, similar to what Stewart did, but but uh, Elijah was forced to, to play too many minutes last year. This year we have more depth because of our two freshmen, so Chemezi and Benny aren't being relied upon to go out and score 18 points for us to win. They can just play their game and play well and play hard and, and go through uh, go through those uh, the learning curve, so to speak, uh, as a freshman and, and, um, and just play their game. So. Uh, it is it is similar, but at the same time, it's a little different because we're a little deeper this year. Seems like you guys have been more aggressive, especially on the glass tonight. You have 25 second chance points. Is that something you all have worked on throughout the course of these four games and practices and things like that? Yeah, we feel like we're athletic and big enough to rebound the ball. Uh, as I said, one of our weaknesses in two of our games was. Uh, defensive rebound, and we need to rebound a higher percentage. I thought we did a better job tonight, and we were also pursued the ball on the offensive end. So uh, we, we think we can become a good rebounding team. We just and tonight was the first step. Thank you. Miles, coach. Um, you know, last week in the first four games, you were one and three. You know, obviously now you're four and one. What are some, you know, some changes that you see this season now compared to last? Well, we're more talented. We're a year older. Our players have improved their skill sets, their decision making, their bodies, meaning they're stronger, and, and they have a understanding of what it takes to win at this level. Uh, last year we were the youngest team in the country in the Power Five conferences, and, and they had really didn't understand uh, what it took, to <laughs> how hard you have to work, and how good the teams and the players we're playing against are. And, and so uh, I think they uh, they really made a commitment to each other and, and to the team concept, and, and we're just better better team. Okay, thank you, and happy Thanksgiving to all. Thank you.